Davido and Choma follows each other once more. Is this a sign of them coming back together? Who knows? Before we get started, please like this video. Don't forget to also subscribe and turn on the bell notification so I'll be the first to be notified anytime we drop our video so you can actually be the first person to experience these videos. And also, what do you make up of Davido and Choma following each other once more? Please, I'd like to hear from you in the comment section below. Quickly, we'll be examining JMK's reaction to her body. She said, if you can't see past my physical attributes, then that is on you. Now, she was actually dragged for twerking in bikini. Let's quickly take a look at the series of this video she spoke out. And please drop your honest opinion down below. There and be extremely confident in my body. Like, it took me a long time. Forget that, oh, JMK is hot. JMK has a big ass. JMK has a nice body. Forget all of that. It took me a while to get here. I was body shamed a lot. I was called different names as I when I was younger, but now I'm like growing. I'm growing every day. I can't be, you know, trying to water myself down or trying to wear certain things that don't befit my body just because of oh, what will people say? You don't want people to see you this way. You don't want people to see you that way. See me anyhow you want to see me. I just feel like it's your mentality. This is 2021. If you can't see me past my physical attributes, then that's on you. That's not on me. So please, I just wanted to clear the air about the whole, oh, she did fine market, all that nonsense. I'm not, I don't need to do all that. It is not that. I went to the beach and I wore a bikini. There's nothing, bikini is for the beach. It is not for going to the restaurant. I wore what was appropriate for the beach. So all that nonsense some of these people have been saying is for your pockets i really don't give a sh i just had to address it please leave the girls alone it is bad enough that we get hit from different people we're still trying to build our self-confidence we're still trying to wear whatever we want without caring or giving a sh about what people would say so be kind enough and not add to our problems thank you the Big Brother Ninja star JMK has reacted after being dragged for twerking in bikini. She was seen in a video twerking in a bikini. The reality TV star recently posted a twerk video on her Insta story. She was seen twerking at the beach and exposed her butt. She was also seen bragging about her natural body. The comments that followed has been heavy backlash. Many social media users have lashed out at her for showing her butt. JMK, who is a lawyer and a mother of one, has reacted to the backlash. She said, I can't be trying to wear certain things because of what people will say. If you can't see past my physical attributes, then that's on you. Now, what do you make up of these posts? And um, why would people be backlashing or, um, you know, throwing banters up on people that are wearing or dressing the way they want in public i'd like to know that because um, it's getting out of hand a lot of persons in nigeria well i don't know if they are self-righteous or something but if you are going to the bikini you ought to sorry if you are going to the beach you ought to put on something light probably a bikini as she did but i wouldn't understand why she was being lashed at or probably because of the twerking she was doing in the video what do you make up of this story? Do you think that ladies should be left the way they are? But um, if you come to examine this scenario, in cases like this, women are the one lashing on themselves. If you, say, if you want to make a ratio or a percentage of the persons, the gender that will be lashing out on females if they put on something that um, shows their body, 80% is from the ladies. I really do not know why most ladies don't support each other, but that is what I deem fit. I don't know if you have a contrary opinion. If you do, please comment down below because um, ladies actually, I don't know, most of them, they don't like each other. What do you make up of this? Please let me know in the comment section below. And what do you think about James K's outfit? Do you think it was dope or do you think she twerked well or, you know, let me know in the comment section below. Now, um, back to Davido and Choma. The most talked about duo in Nigeria when it comes to relationship, Chef Chi and Davido. 
have followed each other on Instagram once more. Well, after many months though of separation, so the billionaire singer David O and his ex fiancee Choma Roland have followed each other on Instagram months after they separated. Now, what do you think comes to your mind? The first thing that comes to your mind, what will that be? Please let me know. David O and his baby mama had earlier unfollowed each other on Instagram following an alleged cheating allegation. Their relationship had gone wrong when David O was spotted having closeness with, closeness with American mother Mia Yafai. This was months before their earlier planned wedding. Their wedding, which was planned to take place in 2020, was suspended, though as a result of coronavirus. However, recently the award-winning singer and his baby mama got close during their son Ifain's birthday. Now, this is where they say kids or children are blessings to their parents. What do you make up of this? Okay, a few days after their son's birthday, the two lovers have followed each other again. This has raised the suspicion of netizens, as many believe the ex-celebrity couple might reunite and start their love affair over again. Now, um, this is what I always tell my friend. Once it comes to love or relationship, you do not put your mouth, because if you tend to advise one party over the other, definitely they will do what's in their mind and not have to your advice, because... Naturally, the human mind works on its own. This disregards all facts of um, advice given by friends, family, or foes. But what do you make up of David and Choma getting back together? And um, can we be saying it is possible that this duo will definitely get married? I don't know, but um, it's just a prediction. And um, if I had a foresight seeing the future, definitely. I will tell you guys right now if David Doe and Choma are going to get married, but I don't. Humans are uh, they're unique on their own behavior. I, I can't predict what will happen, but this is a this is a step towards fixing their relationship. And um, if you root for David Doe and Choma, I'd like to hear from you in the comment section below what you think regarding this couple following each other. But as for me. I think they are trying to let bygone be bygone and make up for the last time they've been separated. And I would really, really, really want to see this couple together because I think they are my favorite. But um, no relationship without problems. It depends on how you face your problems. David on the other hand, is a big celebrity and uh, definitely different news or rumors or allegations are going to be lashed on David it depends on how they take care of these forthcoming problems. But what do you make up of these um, celebrities following each other? I really like to hear from you in the comments section below. So if you've been following my channel, I talked about why do you think um, Licorus or what do you make up of Licorus recent um, see-through dress that she wore to an event. I didn't make up that video. So in today's video, I'll be talking about it. If you want to hear about that video, just go to my previous video you see it there. So Licorice replied to fans or the people that have been dragging her on social media regarding her dress. She said, why them come the para? Well, she finally reacted after she was dragged for wearing a see-through dress to an event. The reality TV star Licorice has reacted to the heavy criticisms she has been receiving from social media users over the see-through dress she recently wore to an event. But first, what do you make up of these acts from Licorice? Remember or recall we earlier talked about JMK who was saying um, if you can't see past the body that you should just forget about it. I think ladies, I don't know but let us move on but if you have an opinion regarding um, Licorice outfits, please let me know in the comment section below. The Big Brother Ninja X housemate came under serious criticism after she rocked a see-through dress to an event, imitating singer Rihanna. The dancer who has been silent ever since the event has now reacted. She took to her Twitter page and asked why people are angry at her. Why them come de para, 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 she tweeted, well, to that music for her. In another news, Licorice during an interview with the Legit NG opened up on why she participated in the Big Brother Ninja show. She stated that she went for Big Brother Ninja because of her financial instability. She said, I had financial issues. I need financial stability in my life. 
people don't see that people don't know that they just see that oh she has over 700k followers what's she gonna look for in the big brother ninja house she said but naturally the amount of followers you have doesn't necessarily mean you are worthy in which in the real in the reality aspect of life now i think a lot of persons in this world they judge too much but if you think I'm wrong please let me know in the comment section below and the actions of others are we really meant to judge these giving persons if you come to think on fits well you be the judge let me know in the comment section below this marks the end of today's video if you have a contrary opinion regarding all that i've said in today's video and uh, most especially choma and davido getting back together after they followed each other well please let me know in the comment section below Thanks for watching today's video. If you are yet to subscribe, please smash that subscribe button, smash the like button, and you know, have a great day. Goodbye. Good night. Please.